Yo, welcome to day 40, 40, welcome to day 54 of skateboarding across America and our skateboards right now, I'm just waking up next to these loud ass trucks, it's like a rest stop or something, but um, I'm getting some, I'm gonna get some breakfast right here across this gas station, see what they got, something good, it's 40 degrees out today, not too much wind, you guys can see it's cloudy, it's very cloudy today, um, it doesn't say it's gonna rain, it just shows it's cloudy. So that's a good thing. We just gotta bundle up and get everything all rocking and going. Got some good sleep last night. There was a jacuzzi at the hotel last night, so we're just chilling in the jacuzzi and it felt so fire. But um, yeah, let me just grab something real fast and then I'll continue talking. What do I want? I want that Cafe Europita. I don't. Oh, hang on, uh, I'll get this one. Organic Guatemala. Yeah. Yeah, I just got a coffee. They didn't have anything else to really eat in there, bro. It was just a bunch of candy and nuts, and I'm not trying to just eat candy and nuts, but um, we actually have someone on their way right now to uh, come pick us up and skate with us. Uh, like I said, we welcome everybody to come skate, but yeah, we're gonna be, uh, going to our checkpoint which is not too far from here and um i think they're gonna have luke to stay in the car and they're gonna keep driving it depends but yeah today's gonna be a beautiful day it's gonna be a great day get the coffee going hopefully the hotel has some leftover food um if you guys didn't see yesterday's video go watch yesterday's video bro go check that out comfort in they get they hooked it up for free last night because what we're doing so shout out to them for just hooking us up and yeah, my legs are feeling great. My feet are fine. Everything's perfect. I'm just ready to push, bro. We're trying to be there by December 9th or December 10th. Mid-December in uh, to New York City. So <clears throat> we're trying to check out all these. We're trying to check out all these miles right now and make sure we actually do get there. And that's just the goal. And because we, we want to be somewhere around the 13th. So let's see if we can do it. Got a nice little view. Look at this thing. It's a bunch of fields, bro. Oh, you can't even open it. They have these little things right here. Filled it up. Nice little hotel room. Feel me? Show you a nice. Trekaholics mixtape. New and exclusive. <laughs> New and exclusive. Got some special for y'all today. Ooh. What, what is that? Oh, sh. <laughs> oh, no. Let's get it. Bop, 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 bop. <laughs> Let's get it. Look at this full Oreo in 2020. <laughs> I was telling him he should do that when he's pushing. He should still play. <laughs> yeah, just still playing right there. <laughs> you should do that, bro. It's from don't... October 4th, 2020. Yeah, don't brush your teeth right now. Save it. I was on a road trip with uh, two other homies. We were in the car for like three months. <laughs> and you had to brush your teeth that day, huh? Yeah, dude. That's what I was doing. What was the moment right there? How did that build up right there? I was just... I think I already had my head out the window, and we we're just going down one of the interstates, and then I'm just like, why not? <laughs> <laughs> why not? Yeah, I gotta brush my teeth real quick. <laughs> All right, this is the end of this hotel. Let's get it. Card and everything. I appreciate it. Yes, <laughs> we're gonna try our best to stay warm. So, well, we keep our body warm while we're pushing, so then we just got all heated up. We just gotta keep on pushing. And then, uh, yeah, we won't even feel the, the air. We do want you guys to be safe. You're going to get some snow and then so. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate you for that. Have a good day. You too. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's just send it in here, bro. This is how we're getting to our checkpoint. We had to ask these kind people to help us get to our, our location. And we have to lay in the back, back here. So this is where we're going. So random, but this is what we have to do, bro. See my gloves? They should have been right there. Thank you. Just lay. Yeah, she said this to lay down. This is the craziest thing ever, bro. You should put that sweater on, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna put it on right now. Thank you again. You're welcome. Let me have those waters so I can get them out of your all's way. You sure? 
water. Um, I think we're okay for now. Alright. Thank you. Uh, just, I'll just leave this right here. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> hey y'all. Uh, this is how we do it. It's our ride. This is our ride for today. It's so cold too, bro. This is gonna be freezing. How you feeling, Luke? Pretty good. <laughs> Off we go. Funny page cafe. This is so crazy. I literally just asked them. I had to give them the whole rundown so they won't think we're just random crazy people. And she was cool with it. I offered 20 bucks, but I don't think she wanted to take it. It was nice out here. Bye, bye. <laughs> These old ladies are just laughing at us. She's covering her face. <laughs> Is she? Oh, because I'm filming, huh? Oh, dude, she really not about it. What kind of feathers you have there? Oh, these ones are um, from a, a red tailed hawk, I believe. Is it just in this area? Or? No, it's a federal thing. Uh oh. So it just heads up. Checkpoint. I made it. I kept my inner flame lit. <laughs> yep. It worked good. My hands are freezing. I can't even feel them. All right, so this is our checkpoint for today. And we're going to push. Hopefully, we're going to try to find someone uh, to take Luke to a train station. Because, yeah, we're going to try to find that so he could go to a train station. So he could go back home. But for now, we got to keep pushing. And he's able to still push, like, a little bit. So that's what the plan is today. And uh, we're going to see what's up. We're going to see what's up. Just kind of going with the flow right now. So, yeah, we're trying to figure out a bunch of things right now. We already started moving. But... Um, yeah, just trying to find out how to get Luke back to somewhere so where he could get like a, a train ride back home because We're kind of in the middle of nowhere in a way There's no really big cities out here. So we're still trying to figure it out but meanwhile, he's gonna be pushing with us and uh, We're just gonna have to trek through whatever we can right now Gonna see what's up. But I'll definitely keep you guys updated as we get closer to this town again and I'll let you know. Okay, we try our best. Um, I know. Our, 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 our little thing what we're doing is when we go down these hills and we're, as we're going up this hill, we stay on this side so we have more eye space right here. But as we go over the hill, we kind of scoot this way. But, you know, as I went by and come back up, I saw you all getting out of the way of cars. So yeah. that just be careful, guys. That's all I ask. Cool. Okay. Are you, uh, are you, uh, can you run to Moberly? Like, are you staying? Like, you guys could go that far? Uh, we cover the entire county. Okay. Well, we have a buddy over here who has a uh, like leg problems right now, and he came all the way from uh, Arizona to come push with us. We're pushing cross country right now, and uh, I was gonna say maybe he could get a ride. Oh, absolutely. Okay, that'll be helpful because oh, yeah, he's he's not feeling too well on his legs. Where are you? Where are we? Where to go? So somewhere nice and warm for him. Okay. Yeah, we can. I can make that happen. We already, yeah, we came from uh, Venice Beach, California. Really? Yeah, we came from Venice, Venice Beach, and we're going straight to New York. We're doing it for a charity. 
and we've been we've been doing this for 54 days already so it's been a ride but thank you for hey thank you for being so cool i it's appreciate my you pleasure i mean you're all like hey you're all really not doing it we're all just you know, this often or no skateboards nope i've seen bicycles but not skateboards is it illegal to skate in missouri on the highway uh, it's not illegal it's not we were told it was illegal we had no clue about it but we were told that and we were i was kind of like caught in a I, I never knew that it's more of a safety thing safety i am like i said the biggest thing I've said twice already, you're supposed to ride against traffic. Against traffic. With. Okay, we'll definitely do that. Thank you so much. Yep. Quite frankly, I'm one of the most laid back officers you will ever meet. As long as you're not doing I'm so like happy you ran into you then. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we didn't, the first time we entered Missouri, we didn't, we had this one cop and he was not having it. And we, we have to push like the whole way. Like we can't get no rides and he made us get a ride. He's like, you cannot ride on this. And it was kind of upsetting, but it's okay. That's how life works, you know? I'm Mike. Luke. Luke, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, so, yeah, I'll get there. Call us when you get there. I was going to say, you want to post up somewhere for you guys? Yeah, post up. Through? Yeah, go whatever you need. Like, if you need to go to the hotel or something. I frankly call for anyone, right? I'll give you all three. Right? These I'll, guys have miles to finish. Yeah, we have to push every <laughs> single second. Okay. But I appreciate that. Yeah. Okay. All well. right. Get it, Luke. We'll be there, brother. Yeah, I'll shoot you guys a message. Yeah, shoot us a message when you're there, please. Thank you again. You're very welcome. And we can have one more last lunch or something. Yeah, yeah. Later, Lukeage. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so Luke got a ride with a police officer. So we're chilling now for now to the next town. Well, we might have someone to come pick him up and take him to a train station. I'm trying to figure it out right now, but. For now, we get to push. Oh dang, dude. <laughs> you guys just saw that right now firsthand, right when I started filming. I get always nervous pushing next to the rocks to something like this where the road's right here because you just never know if you hit a rock. Your board goes flying out, gets ran over, or I go flying forward. You never know. I just got to be locked in right here, but these parts are always tricky with these dang rocks, bro. Push back to the same city where we had the hotel at. Some slight. by a car right now. Oh my gosh. Oh! <laughs> How was that car ride for the police? Wasn't too bad. It wasn't bad? With Steve Buscemi. What's his name? Steve Buscemi. That's his name? You yeah. lost my trust forever, Luke. What do you mean? I didn't lie to you. Yeah, you did. I got dropped, he dropped me off over there and I picked What's that? Nah, dude, What's that? You said that box was empty this morning. This, this was. Nah, do you lie to this me again? This is a new one! This is a new one! This is a new one! Right here, caught on camera. You are caught on camera. Throw it on the ground, bro. Full. Crush that. Full. Whoever fucking lost my trust, brother. <laughs> oh, made, made, made me crave it, bro. I'm throwing the roof, bro. God damn it. We're saving you, Luke. Saving me. We're saving you, bro. Don't even dare to pick that one up either. Bro's always trying to get those cigarettes. You're not gonna be able to climb up there, bro. <laughs> you can't do it. You're gonna hurt yourself, bro. Oh, dude, that looks like it hurt, bro. Don't even try. Don't break yourself for some cigarettes. <laughs> Luke said that's the cop. <laughs> Come on, Luke. Come on. <laughs> it's a coincidence. The fact that this guy played Mike Wazowski in Monsters, Inc. Oh my god. And his name was Mike. <laughs> the cop? <laughs> yeah, his name was Mike. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're, we're looking for Steve on the wall. And we found him right here. Okay. It's Mike. That's his name Mike. That's the same one who brought, who brought the homie on me. <laughs> the 
Pupples is right there, posted up. Steve I was like, they better have him. They had all these dogs right here. Oh man, here we go again, bro. Jay Films with another talk that he needs to tell you guys. Oh my god. So you guys are probably like, what is going on, bro? And honestly, bro, I don't know what's going on. But we still pushing across America, bro. We're still gonna do it. There's been some hiccups in this ride, bro. There's been some hiccups. I'm just gonna let you guys know. We can, we're gonna still keep pushing, bro. We're going to New York City. That's that's the goal, bro. We're going there. Um, it's just so funny making these videos, but we came back to the same hotel. Uh, we needed to stay here another night because up ahead is literally nothing for the next 70 miles, 60 miles. So um, we have to stay here because we didn't want to leave Luke by himself. And we think if it's the right thing to do to like do what we're doing right now, staying here, have a nice place to stay, being safe. And then after, cause I do not want to sleep outside <laughs> in like 25 degree weather, bro. It's so cold out here. You guys have no clue, but yeah, I don't, I don't want to be, I don't want to sleep outside. So we came right here and they gave us another night to stay for free. So shout out to the comfort Inn. we appreciate y'all. We love you. But also I did wanted to bring up that someone that watches the videos hit us up and they said they could, they could give us a ride back to our location, right? And the whole day, like they were just telling us that they were gonna, they're gonna help us out. They're gonna push with us. And we're, I was assuming we're gonna push with someone to come, you know, help us out in a way. And uh, this is one I should imply, like I should have no expectations to anyone who says they're gonna come and meet up with us. Uh, but yeah, they said all that and I was assuming they're gonna do that. So I was planning like, okay, if they come, they, then they get to uh, pick us up and take us to our location. So that's why today we had to actually get a ride from this random person because guess what? That person that said I was coming never ended up coming, I don't think. Like, it, they, they just stopped replying to my things. They stopped replying to my messages. So I just took that as like a sign like, all right, we got to figure out what to do. So then I just asked those random people on the side of the road. I was like, can y'all help us? We were supposed to have someone take us to our checkpoint, but um, they're not here. And we waited for them for hours and hours and hours, bro. I, I promise you, we did. We woke up so early and we just waited. But um, we had no choice. We we're 20 miles away from our checkpoint. But yeah, that's what happened. And that's why we got that ride from those random people in the morning. Um, it was just like a, it was like a weird setback day today. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that as well. We have someone coming over tomorrow that's actually gonna help us take Luke to uh, an airport. He's gonna fly him back home. So we've been trying to figure this out all day and uh, we finally got it figured out. So it's gonna happen. And I'm happy that this is, this is all getting said and done. Cause after this, we're gonna start this trekking harder and harder. But um, yeah, man, you guys are awesome, bro. Thank y'all for showing the love and support, bro. You guys are, it, it's just unbelievable. But sorry if this is a shorter video. Uh, normally, you know, we'd be pushing longer. We'd be doing a lot more. But the next couple of days or the next couple of weeks, I don't know how long it's going to take to get to New York City. But just work with us. Work with us and uh, be a little patient because that's what I'm trying to do right now. I'm being patient as well. We're on the same boat. You know what I mean? Um, but enjoy the videos. You know what I mean? Like, I don't think it should be a bad thing that this is kind of taking a little longer than expected because y'all get some cool banger videos and um yeah we just have a good time so everyone's winning and winning you know what i mean so that's what we're doing so the move is staying here tonight start pushing tomorrow early in the morning i, I, I want to get out early in the morning and after that uh let's get out of missouri bro let's just get out of missouri i mean this is so we have many more states to hit and i'm looking forward to it it might rain soon it might snow who knows what could happen there could be icy roads we have a lot to look forward to in the next week or so. And um, I'm excited, bro. I'm excited for this. But I just wanted to keep you guys updated what's going on. That's how cold it is out here, bro. Hopefully y'all can see that. But anyways, you guys have a great night. We only did, I know, y'all gonna be like, that's all you did today. We only did 20 miles. We did 20 miles. We were like 20 miles out of this town and we drove into the town. So now we can leave straight from the hotel. We don't have to come and push into the hotel anymore. And like, you know, we just leave straight here to the next um, location or next city in this case. But yeah, thank y'all for watching. I appreciate you guys. And again, sorry for the smaller upload, but tomorrow we'll get back on it. You guys already know the routine. Uh, this has been day 54 of skateboarding across America. And um, let's keep this going. Keep a, a, a high attitude, a positive attitude, and just, uh, you know, Let's kill it today. See y'all tomorrow and uh, have a great night.